Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Thank you, everyone, for joining me tonight. And for those that are going to watch the replay about Immune System 101, the body's natural defender. I'm so excited for those that are here or will be joining later. And we're going to go over some basics to help you learn a few immune system about your immune system and how you can take control of your health and put your best foot forward this year and every year to come. I love talking about this topic because when I was younger and really felt like I was at the um, healthiest part of my life, I was told I had a weak immune system. I let that thinking as if it was something I couldn't control or change rule me for a really long time. But with some of the things we're going to talk about and some of the things that I've learned, I've been able to personally take control to the fact that in the past seven years, I have not gotten any respiratory illnesses whatsoever. So I love sharing on this topic because unfortunately, as a culture, we tend to only pay attention to our immune system health solely during the fall and winter months, but we should focus on it every season and we'll be able to happily stay above the wellness line all year round. If you constantly feel stressed, get sick all the time, deal with regular stomach issues, or feel abnormally sluggish, your immune system could need more attention than you realize. The state of your body matters, especially when it's exposed to an intruder like harmful bacteria or a virus. So let's keep it in tip-top shape. Now, before you encapsulate yourself in a in bubble wrap and remain isolated for all of eternity... Uh, give me just a few minutes to explain how you can live peacefully in a world covered in germs and bacteria without panic or fear. We will walk through the basics of how the immune system works, learn signs of a weakened immune system, and discover five major ways you can support. So if you are here with me today or watching the replay, feel free to post in either of the comments where you are joining from today, and if there's anything in particular you are looking forward to learning in this class. So here we go, learn the basic. How does the immune system work? If you want to strengthen your immune system, you should first have an idea of how it works. So here's the basics. The immune system is made up of a network of cells, tissues, and organs that work together to protect the body. Its primary job is to keep you safe and healthy. There are two main parts of the immune system, the innate immune system, which you are born with, and the acquired immune system, one that adapts and learns as you age. They're both closely linked and can work together when immune response is needed. The innate immune system is the body's first line of defense. It is primed and ready to fight at all times and consists of things like the skin, eyelashes, mucous membranes, that line the skin's openings and internal tracts. These all create physical barriers to invaders like parasites, toxins, viruses, pathogens, fungi, and harmful bacteria. There are many types of white blood cells within or leukocytes that work to defend and protect the human body, constantly on the lookout for invaders to kill. If the innate immune system gets overwhelmed, it triggers the hypothalamus in the brain to increase the body's poor temperature a fever, and calls on the adaptive immune system to help us fight. The adaptive immune system is much slower to respond to threats and infections than the innate immune response because it's only activated when exposed to pathogens. The cool thing about this system is that it uses an immunological memory to make cells, antibodies, to protect your body from a specific invader. In other words, once it's been exposed to an invader, it remembers it so it can provide long-lasting defense and protection against recurrent infections. The entire process is happening all this time without you knowing. How crazy is that? Well, it happens without your knowledge when you're healthy. The second you start seeing symptoms arise, you'll know it's at work. So keep in mind that although symptoms may be uncomfortable, they're simply proof that the immune system is hard at work. Bring your body back into balance, it craves. A special note, for babies less than one year old who don't have an adaptive immune system yet, antibodies can be received from their mother via breast milk or donor milk. So an incredible process, especially for those that like a little bit of science. Now, going on to what are the signs of a weakened immune system? We've talked about how the immune system works 
Now we are going to dive into some more practical information. What are the signs of a weakened immune system? Your stress level is always high. This means your adrenal glands, your stress and energy glands are shot. And your cortisol gas pedal is pressed to the floor. Stress hormone. You're spending way too much time in flight or fight mode, leaving you exhausted. Your immune system will suffer greatly if you aren't subsequently allowing your body to spend time in rest and repair mode. I've been in this situation for sure. Number two, you're always sick. Typically when a person falls ill, the body's adaptive immune system creates antibodies and learns how to defend itself against that intruder if presented with it again. If your body thinks you catch everything that's going around and continually does that sickly, sick, sick, look, sick, look, your immune system could need some serious attention. And I've been definitely in that uh, again when I was a teenager and then once again, Later in life, it seemed every winter, I was always just like congested for four months in the wintertime living in Michigan and uh, would have to do all types of things just to barely stay above it. You have regular stomach issues, have had this as well. Did you know that nearly 70% of your immune system is in your gut? Yeah, there's actually good bacteria present there that supports a healthy digestive system. An immune system. If you're noticing things like diarrhea or constipation becoming part of your normal routine, chances are your immune system isn't functioning functioning optimally and your gut health needs work. You don't heal quickly. Number four, when your body is injured, like a cut, bruise, or burn, nutrients within the blood rush to the area to help it heal. Quick healing requires healthy immune cells. If your immune system isn't being properly cared for, your body, your blood may not have the nutrients it needs to rebuild and regenerate like it should, leaving the wounds susceptible to further injury or infection. Five, you battle frequent infections. If you're noticing things like five ear infections in one year, pneumonia twice a year, several cases of sinusitis a year, or finding yourself constantly needing antibiotics, you could have a weakened immune system in serious need of some assistance. These are just some signs of an immune system in distress. It's very important that you listen to your body and keep mental tabs on how your body acts and responds to the world around it. Up next, we will uncover five major ways you can support your immune system. So stay tuned. So just think to yourself and feel free to put in the comments, which of these signs do you feel like you deal with the most? Or make a mental note of what you want to do some more research on. Now we are going to do talk about five major ways to support your immune system. Herbs. So I am certified in herbs. One particular one that I've loved for a really long time is echinacea. It's a great herb to keep on hand. You can typically find an herbal tea that contains it if that's easier for you, which is one way I love to do it. A 2012 study published an evidence-based complementary and alternative medicine found that echinacea showed maximal effects on recurrent infections and preventive effects increased when participants use echinacea to prevent the common cold. Elderberry is another plant often used for its array of health benefits, including its ability to fight colds, the flu, allergies, and inflammation. The ginseng plant, root stems and leaves, is also quite beneficial for immune system support and can play an important role in antibody production. The foods. Now, you guys also know that I am certified in nutrition, hydration, and easy and achievable weight loss. And I use an amazing tool that anyone can use remotely that you can run every two weeks in order to ask your body exactly the right foods that it needs to get the right nutrition. So, if you're listening to this and you are one of the many people, because I've helped hundreds of people in the past three years that have purchased the scan, but you haven't ran in the past two weeks, make sure you do that as soon as you're done with this. And if you haven't blessed yourself with this tool, make sure you message me to get that. Some specific things that can help are bone broth. It's an excellent food option for supporting both your immune system and digestive system. The collagen amino acids within can help heal Hairs in the gut lining, which in turn helps the immune system function properly. Ginger is another fantastic food to incorporate on a regular basis. It's known for its ability to help cleanse the 
lymphatic system and rid the body of toxins and waste. It also helps the body maintain a healthy inflammatory response. Green tea is filled with antioxidants and amino acids that can help you fight germs and stay well. You might also want to keep foods rich in vitamin C, like citrus fruits and bell peppers on hand. They provide anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties. Foods rich in beta carotene, like carrots, pumpkins, sweet potatoes, red bell peppers, kale, apricots, spinach, and collard greens have also been shown to be high in antioxidants, which can reduce inflammation and fight oxidative stress. Three, essential oils. Now, when it comes to essential oils, you guys know I only trust one company because I've had the opportunity to visit several of their farms and they have the seed to seal quality promise and that's Young Living Essential Oil. It's better than organic standards. I know I'm getting premium essential oils that I can trust from the seed all the way to the sealed bottle. One of the things that is extremely important when you are looking for specific immune support is to make sure that you have a trustworthy reference book. If you don't own one, let me know and I could probably hook you up. And when it comes to using specific essential oils for your immune system, definitely check out the Vitality line of Young Living Essential Oils. You can ingest them. Many of them contain antioxidants and can support various body systems, including the immune system. A few that you want to keep on hand, you can also cook with them and that'll give you just the extra boost to your immune system. Some of the, the ones that are the top immune supporting and cost-effective oils to try. These Vitality, I have a tea that I recommend that everyone does every single day. And if you don't know the recipe, I can definitely help you, but that's the top number one that everyone needs to have on hand. Thieves Essential Oil Blend. Also, good ones, Cilantro Vitality, Clove Vitality, Human Vitality, Lavender Vitality, Lemon Vitality, Nutmeg Vitality, Orange Vitality, Oregano Vitality, Rosemary Vitality, Tangerine Vitality, and Thyme Vitality. A lot of those are ones I would definitely like. Clove, Lavender Vitality, Lemon Vitality, Orange Vitality, Oregano Vitality, Tangerine Vitality, Thyme Vitality. A lot of those I will have when I'm traveling um, just to make sure I'm getting that extra boost in my immune system. And again, as I mentioned at the beginning of this, I'm going on seven years with no respiratory issues. And y'all, I'm telling you, like, I will occasionally not wash the weather, be outside, don't have something warm enough, maybe start to get that little tickle, but I just double up, triple up on my stuff. And now I'm seven years free with nothing respiratory, nothing respiratory. Number four, supplements. I also trust Young Living to provide us with quality supplements. They're all backed by their seed to silk quality commitment and infused with premium essential oils to increase their bioavailability in the body. You definitely want to make sure that you're taking their Life 9 probiotic. You want to fill your gut with good bacteria that helps you digest nutrients while boosting the detoxification of your colon and supporting your immune system. Another one that the majority of people that live anywhere in the North or even central part of the United States may want to look at is super vitamin D. Also, if for whatever reason you just can't be in the sun for six to eight hours, remembering that the sun has to actually be on your skin, you're also going to be very deficient in vitamin D. It's one of the essential nutrients needed to sustain human health. I cannot live without Young Living's Super Vitamin D. And it has so many other benefits on top of that. So do your research. There's also two other Young Living supplements that would be great to consider, Master Formula and Super Seat, but we're gonna talk about those in detail later. And then number five, lifestyle. Last but certainly not least, the lifestyle has to do with how you live your life on a day-to-day -day basis. Do your best to manage your, the stress in your life. As you guys know, I'm also certified in mindfulness and self-care and aromatherapy. I know lots of touch therapy techniques and I use them with my clients. So you want to do your best to manage the stress in your life. 
stimulating the vagus nerve, the longest cranial nerve in your body, can help you relieve stress. So how can you do that? Lots of ways that are really simple. You can gargle water, hum, sing, and do mindfulness practices. Get adjusted by a cry chiropractor, laugh, exercise, or immerse your face in cold water. Make sure you get quality sleep. Get at least seven hours a night and you will have a better chance of keeping your immune system running optimally. You may also want to consider your water and air quality. Half water is typically laden with chemicals you don't want to be consuming. Drink filtered water, go outside to breathe in fresh air. And also environmental wellness is super important. That was a key to, to healing my immune system. No longer really suffering from allergies nor asthma. When I got toxins and improved my air quality out of my home, things like candles and plug-ins and replace them with diffusers, that was key to improving my respiratory health. Now we are going to go into some in detail into a couple of these supplements that are some must have. Master Formula is a powerhouse full spectrum supplement. So back to speaking to implementing quality supplements into your routine, let's talk about one that's packed with all kinds of good things, Master Formula. This is a full spectrum supplement that provides vitamins, minerals that can help support bone density and health, brain function, cellular protection, digestive health, energy levels, eye health, heart health, immune support, and skin health. Master Formula's food-based ingredients are delivered in three ways for a synergistic complex that supports digestive health, helps neutralize free radicals in the body, provides gut flora supporting probiotics. Plus, it has premium essential oils packed within. This is one that I definitely take on a regular basis, and my primary care physician suggests that everyone needs to be on a multivitamin. This is an excellent one. I alternate this one and sleep citrus one usually. Another bonus that you want to make sure that you have in your diet for your immune system is our red juice, Ninja Red. Now, we have full trainings on that, so you can definitely check them out after this. But you, in order to take Master Formula, you just need one packet. It's one liquid capsule, one caplet, and two capsules daily with water, or you can take it with your Ninja Red. Question to ponder on, do you remember to take your supplements every day? How do you create a routine to do so? The next one we're going to talk about is Super C. Looks like I may have skipped that slide on this one. But Super C equals health, vitality, and longevity. Is another great supplement to take a closer look at. It supports normal immune, respiratory, and circulatory function, and is fortified with rudin, citrus bioflavonoids, and minerals to balance electrolytes and enhance the effectiveness and absorption of vitamin C. The added premium essential oils may also increase bioflavonoid activity. The ingredients in Super C also help to strengthen connective tissues and promote overall health, vitality, and longevity. Because your body cannot manufacture vitamin C, you can benefit by consuming this powerful antioxidant daily. To reinforce immune strength, take two tablets daily. For maintenance, take one tablet daily. It's best if taken before meals. Super, super good one. Of course, food is your first line of defense. So make sure that you know what foods and fruits and or vegetables contain vitamin C. Get the best deal. Your body has an amazing web of intricate systems, all working together for one goal to keep you alive and well and feeling amazing, of course. The immune system has one of the greatest jobs of protecting you from intruders, and it deserves all the support that it can get. And I hope that this class has helped you feel more equipped to do just that. So we mentioned two main supplements, plus some other suggestions that are must have to support your immune system. If you happen to be watching this and you're already part of the Young Living family, definitely put these on your next 
monthly health and wellness box. And make sure you keep them on hand to keep your immune system strong. If you're not yet part of the Young Living family, you can get with the person that shared this video with you. And if I happen to be that person, you can contact me so we can make sure that you get the membership price and the best deal you can. Thank you so much for being here. Greatly appreciate it. We'll be doing this class next week at the same time. And actually, it'll be a little bit earlier because I'm realizing that I have another event that day. Uh, so I will <laughs> notify you guys and let you know what time that will be. But we will see you next week to do this in Spanish. We have some amazing additional classes coming up this week. So definitely, definitely, definitely be sure to join us. Thank you and have an amazing evening, guys. Don't forget if you're watching the replay on YouTube to subscribe after this and have an amazing day. Bye, guys.